Personnel at Zelfridge Air National Guard Base hope for the best but train for the worst case scenario. A major accident response exercise, or MARE, is training that tests the abilities of emergency responders by simulating an accident, extreme weather event, or terrorist attack. During a September MARE at Selfridge, simulated explosions at a picnic area caused simulated injuries and casualties. Volunteers wearing moulage applied by the 127th Medical Squadron acted out their injuries as bystanders provided initial care and emergency teams arrived to take control of the situation. The twist to this particular scenario was a radioactive contaminant in the explosions posing a health hazard to everybody on scene, requiring decontamination of responders and bystanders in addition to medical attention for the victims. According to Lieutenant Colonel Ross Dickinson, 127th Wing Plans Officer, this training is a valuable tool for all who take part. It took them to a higher level of challenge, which made them stop, pause, think about how they wanted to solve this problem, and work through it. So it's the first responders, the fire department, the police department, and they work with uh, federal, state, and local agencies in partnership to solve larger problems. And so it's developed uh, our ability to respond to a situation like that and it's taken us to the next level. It's, it's, it's answered some questions, it's created more questions uh, that we have to solve and, and how we're going to solve problems in the future. The Selfridge Fire Department and other units with the 127th Wing came together with FBI, Michigan State Police, and MedStar paramedics from Macomb County for this exercise. For the 127th Wing, I'm Staff Sergeant Rachel Barton.